please welcome to the Green Space stage, Cuarta Tango, performing live in the Green Space. <laughs> years it's an amazing milestone Leonardo is actually one of the finest tango violinists he's leading the the orchestra on Wednesday night but here he is to show off some of his dance moves uh, when is this going on at Lincoln Center so we start tomorrow night on uh, on Tuesday night with Wynton Marsalis and the Jazz at uh, Lincoln Center Orchestra. On Wednesday night, Leonardo's group, Courts of Tango, play, and then we run through July 13th. Gracias. Eh, y antes de retirarme del escenario, quiero presentarles a un grupo que personifica y encarna el auténtico espíritu del tango. Nos vamos de Brasil a la Argentina. Son maestros de la cuerda con una trayectoria legendaria de éxitos a nivel internacional. Así que les voy a pedir que por favor recibamos con un fuerte aplauso a los nominados al Grammy Cuarter Tango, interpretando justo a tiempo. Aquí están. I start Corte Tango uh, because I want to take the Tango Chandra in another level. Most of the audiences in the United States watch tango shows and the repertoire is always kind of the same. It has the big Broadway show kind of ending. Corte Tango is a completely different approach. 
but it's still tango, and that's the most important thing. It's a totally different experience from playing classical as you just described. What was the learning curve like for you? Was it difficult? Yes, it is difficult. You sort of have an idea of what playing is and how you play and how you sound, and you have to get over your ego. It takes a while, but it's, it's very rewarding. formation of tango, you're always going to have the violin. What are some of the emotions and ideas behind the songs? It can go from like sad to very happy very, very quickly. There's a lot of love involved, there's a lot of passion, there's anger. The show itself takes you in a very emotional journey. I have the weight in my back of my father's name and uh, it's something I will never take it out, you know. So before I play I, I am under pressure, always, because I know that people will compare me with my father. So when were you first exposed to tango music? When did you first hear it? Nine years ago mm -hmm. when I first met Leonardo. We went to Buenos Aires and we did a, some concerts there. We were immediately rubbing elbows with a lot of tango greats. Moriré en Buenos Aires, será de madrugada, que es la hora en que mueren los que saben morir. Dará en mi silencio la mufa perfumada de aquel verso que nunca yo te pude decir. Esta noche vamos a tocar en el Colón con el maestro Osvaldo Berlingeri. <tose>
eight years old, my father came in with a little violin. He said, here is your violin, and here is your teacher. That was probably the happiest day in my life.